with me, DC Youngfly. DC Youngfly, he is a comedian, actor, rapper, and podcast host. He's also a veteran cast member of Nick's Cannon, Wild and Out, and a host of MTV's TRL. I can't see your face. <laughs> you don't know if it's me or not. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it may act like Even Allah u Abba. Whatever Allah was handing my partner. Like when you're on the airplane, do you like- That ain't gonna happen, <laughs> ugly no, man. When you on the airplane- ever populated, this is how this shit got people fucking. They I don't fucking. think he can- You, you probably don't know nothing about that cause you ain't, your shit, your shit ain't working no more. You know what I'm mean? saying? So, you know, we out here fucking. Amazing. Yeah, man. Did you vote for him? Hell no, nah, nigga. Hell yeah, I voted. Who did you vote for? I vote for the titties, nigga. Uh, the Great White Hope. Boy, well, you keep calling him the Great White Hope. <laughs> what, what was the reason? First, tell me why you did not vote for him. No, I'm asking you the question. No, no. on enemies, uh, low restrictions. You look for him, motherfucker. You look like you from over there. Amazing. You the KKK, fact. nigga. You want, you want to be white. The fact that we want to be white so bad. You want to divide it? Ain't no, oh look. This is my real estate agent. <laughs> Sorry, we own property. Like, keep going around the same answer. Nigga, I said, you dig what I'm saying? No, 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 motherfucker. You ain't, you ain't all the way out the clear, nigga. You ain't all the way out the clear. If when you you're... move wrong, that's your ass. What do you mean by that? That's your ass. You've been watching the nigga. You, you smart. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? P head. My... You smart. P head. You, mean by you know what's going ass. on. I know police that I fuck with. We. That's the point. Ain't nobody against no fucking body, bro. We are some of the most loving motherfuckers. That's why they want. It. They try to steal our culture. We got all the swag. You dig what I'm saying? They just trying to turn everybody against us. And when you say we are the inventors, nigga, we you created say all they... this shit. We... So, but by you who know, you, nigga, who no, you refer to when nigga, you say who? no. Who you have the ones that America, don't... tear this nigga to figure it out. How that's, do... not, that's nothing wrong with that. When you say queen, you mean women? Yes, no, definitely. And who else the fuck out there? That's all. Somebody talk to you, I hope. Don't look like it. Don't sound like it. And mothers in the home, you think? Black America would do better if we just love each other. Long ago, we people don't understand that we we haven't been free that long. Amazing. So we was in slavery for 400 years. We've been free for about 80. You know, you ain't been paying attention. I grew up in Alabama on a plantation under the Jim Crow law. We were free then. You don't sound like it. not having a stupid so-called civil rights leaders and right. all that crap. Ooh, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> You look like a you like a bug. You was in our neighborhood. Ah, we tell your ass up. <laughs> Come on with it. That's amazing. Atlanta. Better wear your swim shoes because the pool dirty. Amazing. Let him stay anyway. You I'm look trying. illegal, nigga. You didn't make him take your green card, nigga. You look like yeah. Okay, look like you your can't... name Akbar Kapakapa. Fuck wrong with you. Didn't tell you that he was here. Man, what the hell are you talking about? Amazing. Uh, are you for putting up a big beautiful wall around the borders? You know they're gonna ask you, where's Jesse for the wall? Tell him yes. You for everything. Let me tell you what. You wanna go jump in a pool of bleach right now. Let me tell you what. Head first. <laughs> you said this gonna turn me white. Well, I'm going in. That's where you going. He going straight in. You wanna be the same color as this couch. You know what that means? I wanna be tan. This shit mean if you smoke this couch, your ass is hot for life. You smoke pot? <laughs> Who? You. I smoke weed. You do? Talking about pot. That's your problem. Your thinking process fucked up. Don't say pot, my nigga. Pot. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> bring it to your house. I don't want you to bring it. I'd rather go in the store. Sometimes you got to keep fundamental stuff as fundamental. That's like, right. People being lazy. Amazing. You smoke so, pot? No. You, you do a little something? I used to. You don't fuck around? I mean, I used to smoke. When well, I was young, you don't, we you don't fuck around, guy. though. No. Okay. Yeah. Hell no. Nah, I'm just trying to make sure you, you know, you know. Why do you smoke pot? Cricket. No. You know, he's a deacon. You no, know, I didn't watch You it. something around there with your leg crawled like this. We weren't going for that. Amazing. Amazing. Even though I live in L.A. Right. Would you like to know why? Why? Ask me why. Why? He uh, got that many friends. That's why he got a... <laughs> you want to know why? Ask me. <laughs> so I can... <laughs> <laughs> because... Let me tell you why. The Rams supported that thug, um, uh, Kaepernick. Remember him? You know that? like this. Yeah. <laughs> that yeah, shit irking your soul, ain't it? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the Rams supported that. <laughs> that nigga can't breathe right now. He, you? Hell no. Uh, Capping it. There y'all go again. Taking y'all own meaning. Flipping it around. What, what Not listening to what he said. What did he say? First of all, we would never disrespect the flag. Never disrespect what it stands for. But he did. No, he didn't. What did he no, do? No, he didn't. 
Never disrespect the vets who fought for the country. You talking about the world. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? We, we, we getting back to the key point and the key factor. When all this police brutality is going on with African Americans and nobody is saying nothing about it, that's the meaning. That's the stand. It ain't got nothing to do with no flag. So it ain't got nothing to do with no war. It ain't got nothing to do with none of that. It's about what's going on in the country, not outside of the country. We're telling you what it is, but you saying this what it ain't. That's why the problem don't get fixed right there, nigga. Amazing. Oh, old. you have a baby too, right? I damn sure do. Yeah. Y'all want y'all? Yeah. Where your wife? What happened? I had her out of wedlock. I do it what the black people do. Oh. Oh, so you talking lot. all this shit give me, and you give me a hand. talking all hey. that shit, bro. This, he, is. The, this is why he goes with on the side he is. He try to make it seem like he not one of them type of niggas. And nigga, you are one of them niggas. This is what I'm trying to teach. Nigga, you, nigga, are you, you ain't shit. Well I'm proud of you because you were blessed enough to have a baby, nigga. How about hell, no, I ain't married. You been born out well out too. Wet lot like hell. What I'm not proud of you is you are the same type of nigga that you're trying to quote unquote stay away from. When you wake what up in the morning, when you look yourself in the mirror, you run straight out the fucking bathroom. It's, it's, the it's, great it's white hope. About, you are the, the same great white hope. Nigga. Don't forget it. I was Thank hoping you, you asked because I need someone to talk to. I, I can tell you. You need to go to therapy. Let me tell you this, this ain't your therapy, motherfucker. But you need therapy. <laughs> no, you're my psychiatrist. Go right ahead. Oh, it was so you hurt. You were 19, because you look older now. I yeah. know you far from 19. You gained twice, but you know how women I, try you to... You know, I think the problem you know is how women you, try to control you. Would you let a woman control you? She probably didn't want to control you. She just kept telling you, I'm not with that would you stupid let, shit uh, I'm you asking talking. you, would you... No, but I will let a woman have a say-so. But you say so. That is some type of control. Over There's you. There's a difference. She can have a say-so over you. Over, no. She can have a say-so. This is called respect. This is what I'm trying to tell you but, but about respect. You, this is why can, shit don't I'm get done you, because people have, don't have respect for other people's but opinions. Can she have control over you? Would you allow that to happen? She can have a say-so, and I respect her opinion because if it's right, then I'm going to uh, take in, in, in heed and bring it into my life. If your wife was to say something and be like, no, baby, you don't need to do that. You need to do that. She's not controlling you. She's just saying this is something that can better you. And if you're naive enough to not listen to your wife, then that's your dumb ass. Amazing. We risk a crisis in America today with fatherless kids. Have you noticed that? And what fatherless, do you think? Say that shit again. Many kids don't have fathers okay. in America today. Now say fatherless one more time. Cause you said fatherless. It's, I don't know what the hell fatherless. Concerning that. Well, it's, I don't know about no crisis. I know a lot of great mothers that raise their kids. My mother like, you should just pay attention to who you sleep with. Man, you should have paid attention to who you slept with. Why do you think? Her, mama, this ain't got nothing to do with you. This, this is my woman. What are you talking about? The men that they're having the children Why with. Why they gotta be just black? It's white motherfuckers who ain't married. But it's she. really out of love, man. You know, people just worry about love nowadays rather than just marrying the motherfucker. Oh, you yeah. need love, nigga. Speaking you of need love, it. speaking you of love. You need it, Hashemak Akbar. You need love. Allah nigga. Ooh, Akbar. You need love. But what is love? You need a hug. What is love? You need to go to the altar. Let me tell you something. You need to go to a Baptist church, a black church. And I'm take this nigga to a black church. Whoever is ready, take this nigga to a black church, but you got to do it at the end. It's called a benediction. It might take three, four hours, but <laughs> this nigga need it. Okay, thank They're you. They're going to scratch their arms out, and I want y'all to pray for about a day or two. So let me talk about what is a man? A man, a man. This is what a man is. A man is the dominant one. The man is the one who goes out there and take care of home. He's the one who leaves the house. He's the one who gets all the scratches and scars and comes back home and makes sure home is taken care of. The, the man is the person who takes all the beating, but don't nobody in the family feels it. You got other roles you want me to break down? Whatever you want to love, because you know, we got that 1% rule. It don't matter what race we touch, if we touch you, we dominate. So 1% <laughs> mean once you go black, you can't go back? You did. That what you mean? Once we touch you, you did. Yeah, that baby black. <laughs> Cause I well, back in the mean. day, slave terms, you know, some of the slave masters used to rape the slaves. So if you rape a, a slave and she has a child, rightfully that child has the rights to whatever the dad leaves along with the children. 
No, 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 no. You learned Listen, this in, nigga. You learned that in school. Listen. Look, you learned that. I learned that in, in real terminology called the real world, and I looked and opened a lot of books. So listen, if you got 1% of anything in you, you are not white. Um, I'm winding down. What are you? I know Going you have to sleep. A, got all times. You ah, have a. Ah! Learning from other people's mistakes. I learned something from you, too. What's that? Just because you're black, everybody ain't smart. You're dumb in a lot of ways. I'm trying to stay away from. No, I used to be a slap maker. <laughs> a slap maker? Are you a slap maker? That's why you are alone. Are you a slap maker? You are alone right are now. Are you a slap maker? <laughs> you are alone, my nigga. Are you a slap maker? And that shit hurt. <laughs> are you a slap Nigga, do not drink alcohol, and he got alcohol eyes. Rule number one, Let me it doesn't matter how much success you have. I know. This nigga is hurt. Deep down inside, your <laughs> boy is hurt. You just never, seem like you never fucked again. I was going, right. Uh, I was going, so did you wait, wait? Because so it's too late, nigga. You're no, like no, no. 50 at 9, 63. You have a child now, nigga. No, 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 I'm asking no, no. It's called love. Who said marriage so should clarifies I that true definition? Who said marriage is the real definition of love? That marriage means there's a lot of people that's married that ain't happy, bro. That don't mean that is a show. I mean, that's a process. A lot of people that's married they can't even get the fuck out. They want to go. They can't fucking go. Marriage. Guess what? You waited so long. You waited for a dream. We you damn near like a male Wendy Williams, my nigga. You need to have all that shit. <laughs> we ain't talking. You, you funny as fuck. Listen. I'm when you come back, and yes. We're gonna, I'm gonna taste, let you do a little comedian Hell stuff. Hell nah, no, you gotta pay for that. Like, I like this type of shit. You, oh, you, you ain't gonna get me to say shit that I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna want to say. You <laughs> dig what I'm saying? This is like your uncle that come to the family reunion to act like he got all this shit together. <laughs> nigga passed, find out a nigga got them in debt. <laughs> nigga about to lose their house. <laughs> nigga had eight kids, he ain't nobody. You like, God damn. Maybe right. So what I ask is that you make a donation to my nonprofit. Hell no, nah, because I don't know where that shit going. Look, man. Oh, so you got like a boys and girls club for the me. Oh, man, what the wrong with you, man? So will you, will you help me to help them? I gotta see who the hell you have me yeah. first. Oh, check this nigga. So, yeah. can I give you some advice? Yeah. Don't put Beijing on your mustache. Uh, Cause that shit going in your nose. Do you put I, makeup? Thank you all for tuning in. No, don't do that, it. no, nigga. I, no, uh, don't do it, no, nigga. And now zoom no. in. That nigga got that shit in it. No. Tell me about this. Is it in nose, y'all? And what's your name again? No, my name DC, nigga. You oh, don't know DC, me, bro. Young fly. Bro. Yeah. DC, man. Young fly. Thank you, man, yeah. for coming on. I throw his ass up, y'all. Cut it up. Hey, ah, ah, ah. Now, let the whole shit play. No. Let the whole shit play. Right. Don't cut it up and be, ah, ah. I'm going to know. I'm going to die, OG. All right. <laughs> All right, man.